Hi everyone, I'm Gordon Harrison. I am currently standing in the foyer of our lake house property at Pine Point. And I'm very proud to introduce another collection to you. The collection, this collection, um, one of the pieces in this collection is hanging on the wall behind me. And the name is the, of the collection is called Symphony de l'Automne. La Croche is um, the subject of this collection and La Croche brings back many, many fond memories for residents and cottage goers on, on our lake. Starting back in the 1930s, my grandfather Smith and his family would spend the day at La Croche. They would hike from our lake through the back fields over to La Croche. They would bring a picnic lunch and they would spend the day there fishing and swimming in one of the many bays of this very pristine lake. Today, three generations later, I continue to visit La Croche in the fall. The fall colors are spectacular on this lake. It is possible that the same trees that existed back in the 30s can continue to tell the story of generations of families on this lake. I'm going to move a little bit closer to show you the tea details of this painting. However, in this video, I will take you through the different stages of my process from start to completion to create a painting in this collection. This painting framed is available and the canvas size is 36 high by 84 wide. So, Welcome to Symphony de l'Automne. Hi everyone, I am in my studio at Pine Point. In front of me is a blank canvas, an 18 by 18. And I'm going to paint La Symphonie de, de l'Automne. I always have inspiration around me when I start, so I have a couple of paintings that I've painted in this collection beside me. I'll show you these paintings. This is one, this is a 1236 in this collection. And the second one is a 18 by 18 canvas as well. So this is my inspiration, which I require. And I start with a pencil sketch. So I will do a pencil sketch of this image, this collection, and I will show you at completion. Thank you. So I have just finished my pencil sketch. It took me about uh, 15 minutes. And what I'm going to do now is I go over my pencil sketch with Indian ink. So I will show you a black sketch on a white canvas. We are looking at the black sketch that I've just finished. Uh, just add a few more lines here. As you see, I like to do a nice black sketch linking up all my lines. And then that is pretty well finished for my black sketch. I've um, done a little bit of um, shading in the back in the sky. So that is done. I will show you my color palette that I will be working from. This color palette I like to prepare in advance. So I have all my working colors in front of me when I paint. Hi, it's, it's Gordon. I just wanted to show you the progress of the, the painting. Um, I've just started. As you notice, I started with a bit of a green wash, sap wash in parts of the painting. I tend to do this quite a bit. Uh, place a wash in certain parts of the canvas, then wipe it off and paint on top. I'm going to continue with the sap green wash and I'm going to place it uh, in the water and in the sky and then I'm going to wipe that off as well. 
I've done the sap green in both the water and the sky and I'm just working on the water at the moment and I will put a very light pale yellow in the sky similar to the painting in front of you. The big reveal. This is the painting I've been painting. The size is 18 by 18. I have framed it and signed my name. If there's a painting on the video that you'd like to purchase, please contact the gallery. If there's a commission piece that you would like me to do, um, I'd be more than happy to do so. Thank you for watching the video. Stay safe.